Okay. So look, um, this next person coming up, uh, she told me to introduce her this way, so don't look at me like, what? When I say it, because they told, they told me to do it. That's what they told me. So coming to the stage, next comedian, um, she's also a veteran. She's not new to this. Uh, introducing Melania Trump.
bring all of the first lady goes together. And I said, okay, important group thing for country. How do I get out of my first lady job? <laughs> well, you're not going to believe. Abraham Lincoln's wife, she said, you both should go to more theater. <laughs> I said, ladies, I'm not trying to kill him. serious heart attack, he would have to resign, and then I can go back to my rich, fulfilling life in Trump Tower, staring out the window. But how? How do you give someone like that with power and money to get out of everything? How do you give him a heart attack? <laughs> well, McKinney's wife said, you want to give the a heart attack? Just tell him you had a threesome with Rosie O'Donnell and a Mexican gardener. <laughs> Okay? Listen, I don't care if a donkey runs. It's better than the ass we have in there. <laughs> that is a joke, of course. Because <laughs> one must not bite the hand that pays for the Botox. <laughs> oh, God. But if the Democrats are doing it, then that's really for real this time. Let's hashtag send Melania back. <laughs> Not this, sorry, Trump Tower, that, not a road. Okay. Oh, fans, fans, fans. Okay, so listen, people can't stop talking about my fashions. Oh. You know, when I wore that I don't care the you jacket, I think it showed how empathetic I really am. Because it's an angsty statement. And who's more angsty than kids in cages? Okay, okay. Everyone's still sensitive. Okay. I will tell you the truth. H&M had me wear that jacket in exchange for, drum roll please, money! I mean, you could say that I'm in golden handcuffs, but that's my sex life. <laughs> it's my Donald's and I favorite sexy time game, it's Princess Leia and Jabba the Hutt. <laughs> Some people groan in the back. Listen, but what about me? I'm still trying to figure out how to get orange stains out of my vagina. Oh! Yeah. My underwear looks like a bag of crumbled Cheetos. <laughs> so you've been so good. I'm going to now give you quickly, I'm going to give you my Slovenian prayer. Slovenian prayers work so well for me, and now I teach to girls around the world as part of my Be Best campaign, okay? Are you ready? So, gonna breathe in and repeat after me. Marry Rich! Alright, so listen, okay, I'm new to this comedy team, so I heard that being mean makes you funny. So I thought I'd just be myself. And we play a game called Fashion Police of Politics. How it works is I say five, you say five, we count down together, and each time I tell you a thing about you that reminds me of people in politics. Uh, you look so nervous, sir. Okay, why don't uh, Melania Ross Melania first? Okay, that's all I have so much to say. Okay, Melania, okay, I'll do it. Okay. Five. Five. Okay, let's do better than that, Mabel was. Okay, ready? Five. Five. Okay. I have the very high heels of someone who wants to stay far away from ground of reality. <laughs> That's me, okay. Four! Four! Oh, darling, you had the nice, sweet, open face of a White House intern before she starts. <laughs> before she, and you have the Stormy Daniels blonde hair, I can't even really look at you. <laughs> Out of there, okay. Three! Three! Sir, so that's a, a, a nice button-down shirt, very hip, I feel. You know, it's something like Joe Biden would wear when he wants to be very hip and with the people. <laughs> right, okay. Two! Two! Okay, hi everyone. I'm just so glad to see you all. Um, listen, I live in the White House. You're the first people of color I've seen in three years. <laughs> and one! One! Oh my goodness, I love this. You look like you've been Fortnite in your mother's basement for many hours a day. <laughs> Thank you.
White House, okay? Alright, so, oh, I only have like, oh, no, I have no time, I have a rap, and I don't think I have time to do, no, I don't have time for my rap. Oh, shit. I'm just gonna do, okay, I'm gonna leave you with a homage, homage to Andrew of the Dice of the Clay. Okay, and then after the show, come, come take picture, I'll, I'll leave on the way, I mean, come take a picture with me. Okay, homage to Andrew of the Dice of the Clay, okay. <laughs> Humpty Dumpty sat on the wall. Don and Eric had the great fall. And I hope Ivanka falls too and gets run over by a clock! Hey! Hey! Okay. Donald Wondled pudding and pie. Jerked off in Stormy's eye. When her lawsuit was dry and shut, can you believe even then Donald still wanted to fuck that one that slut? You want these bombs, I give you the bombs. Okay, last one. Hickory Dickory Duck. Another porn star is sucking Donald's cock. The clock struck two, she said me too. And Donald had Jeffrey Epstein killed in his sub block. Hey! Vote to 2020 and get me out of that White House of Garbage, Maplewood, okay? <laughs>